Yo, what's up Freeze Army and welcome to Marrakesh's first challenge I'm going to cover, which is called Don't Use That Turn. So for this video, we're going to go for 15 likes, so if you can, please hit that like button below, and uh, without further ado, we're just going to get straight into this video. So we're going to start off in, of course, the main entrance. Not how many people are going to have any other entrances that are locked. The situation grows more tense by the minute. In fact, I'll let you listen to this. The consulate is under lockdown, but the protests are only a stone throw away from full-blown riots, and Zaydan won't hesitate to unleash his troops. So whatever you're planning, time is of the essence. Good luck, 47. Okay, so for this, we don't need any special equipment. All we need is going to be needing our is our coins. And uh, we're going to start off from the normal main entrance, obviously. And we're going to follow this direction. We're going to head to the other side of this place. Not f not completely too familiar with everything so far. It's my first day playing, but uh, I just thought I'd get a challenge out there to give everyone a bit of a taste. People that didn't tune into the stream. Give everyone a bit of a taste of what Marrakesh looks like. Well, small part of it anyway. So we're going to head to these back alleys here. And we're going to go in the, in the corner area. There'll be a bunch of print workers there, and what we're going to need to do is trigger a conversation. While just being in this area, this guy will trigger a conversation, and uh, that's going to trigger a scene, of, you know, a chain of events. What we're going to need to do. So, what we're going to first need to do is take one of these guys' outfits. So, to do that, we're going to come over here, just around this corner, and we're just going to get into this uh, this alleyway here, just inside, inside this door. So the print worker is going to come around the corner, and this is where we're going to cause a distraction. So it's a perfect opportunity for us to uh, to distract him, and a good, good place for him to, to hide his body as well. So just watch your map, and watch that uh, blip on your radar. And uh, just about, just as he's about to go past the door, that's when you want to throw your coin. So if you've timed it just right, you should be uh, coming your direction. So you want to close the door before you subdue him. And once you've subdued him, you want to hide him in the crate. And then head back to the uh, the print workers and uh, talk to them. And then from then, they're going to lead you to the school, which is where you're going to need to be do need to complete this challenge. So we're going to head over to the, cor uh, the corner now to talk to the print workers. And we're going to need to follow them, which is going to take quite a while, so I will fast uh, fast forward this Done. next part. Yeah, why not? And then uh, anyway. play it at the relevant part. So now you've spoken to these workers, they're going to walk slowly to the school. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to speed this up a little bit. So see you in a minute. So we're just going to play it there. I hope you enjoyed that fast forwarding music. That's going to be a tradition from me from now on. Be, uh, having fast forward music. So once we get in here, this general is going to make a bit of a speech. And then, well, he's not a speech or such, but he's going to tell everybody to. To the other city districts and suburbs. This means there will be no breaks, not until the job's done. So whatever you do, just keep those printers running. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. What the? So everyone's going to leave the room, and uh, there's going to be three print workers left. Uh, two of them are going to leave the room, and that's what you're going to wait for. So you're going to wait for two of these print, print workers to leave, and then uh, we're going to take out the third. Then I'll show you what happens next. So this guy's going to leave first. I don't know why uh, they left anyway, I'm not completely sure. But you need them out of the way to complete this challenge anyway. So, that's bye bye, goodbye to one of them. And uh, this should be goodbye to the other. 
So once he's left and once he's cleared the room, we're going to take out this third print worker and hide him in the crate. Just near the side of the room. To subdue Going to stick his body in the crate over here. And I'm going to turn the, turn the printer off. I'm going to wait for the general to come back down the stairs. And uh, they may, this may take uh, a couple of minutes again. I'm going to speed this up. But I'm not going to clear the music this time. I'm just going to speed this up a little bit more. So I want you to let me know in the comments below what challenges you want me to complete on the channel. I'm going to pass it over to you guys because I'm not completely sure what challenges you want me to do. So if anything you're struggling with, please let me know in the comments below. I'm more than happy to help you out. So once we, I'm going to play it here. So basically when the general comes in through the room, he's going to find out that the printer's not working. And he'll come over and uh, turn it back on. So once he has it turned back on, he's going to head his way around to the front. And that's when we're going to push him into the print work printer. There's a someone could hurt yourself challenge and the challenge should pop right there. So that's going to do it for this episode. So I hope you enjoyed it and I hope it helped you out. As always, uh, subscribe here if you want to join the ever-growing Freeze Army of Assassins. And I'll see you in the next video, guys. Cheers.